Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to some more Civ 5 as Poland, where we last left off. Uh, we're just doing some maintenance. We just found out that France is actually beating me in tech, which is kind of disturbing. It won't be that way for long, uh, given that I'm getting a great scientist pretty quickly, and uh, everything's kind of kind of boosted up in terms of science. I'm also going to rush the, um, sat the satellite thing. Yeah. And hopefully I'll have that tech before the next vote, in which case I'll be able to go International Space Station. And then I'll, I'll want that, because that would be amazing to have. Uh, usually I don't, the game doesn't last long enough for that to become of any use, but I think it will this time. Uh, maybe, Elite. We might play CAH again. Maybe. Minecraft being bought, um, the whole that whole thing is I'm actually it's 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 fine. There's nothing wrong with it. I mean, obviously, I'd rather have it. I, I'm not a huge fan of Minecraft. It's okay. It's fun. But I'm not like a diehard fan. But it's actually probably better that it's in the hands of Microsoft now because he just didn't want the responsibility. And that's always dangerous. Oh, you know, let's take your spices. So it's better to be in the hands of someone who wants to, to grow with it than not at all. Ooh. Oh, paratroopers, right. Should I do that strategy? I came up with a really good strategy, which is basically paratrooper spam. I just build like 20 paratroopers and then just have them all land all in the enemy territory and then just wreck havoc. <laughs> of course, they're only really effective once you get the XCOM squad. But, uh... See how far can you paradrop to? Where's the border? Oh, it's right here. That's, see, that's not very far at all. But XCOM squads are great because they can go like 40 tiles. It's ridiculous. And you're going to go to the capital. <clears throat> Should I do that? I could probably afford the upgrade, but I'm going to want them all in Warsaw, so they're all pretty good. And I'm building a lot of stuff in Warsaw, unfortunately. Okay... Seven to become their ally. If I become their ally, it'd actually probably be for the best. I could just buy Amity, huh? Instead of taking it over, I could just buy it. What do you guys think? Should I just should should I do a conduct a trade mission or should I just flat out buy it? Cause I won't get I'll get the silver, which I don't think I have. No, I have ten silver. <laughs> so never mind. I have the silver. Um it'll basically give me another city. Which doesn't kill me. And it is militaristic, which I'm actually okay in taking over. But I get, and I get, th I'd only get three coal out of it instead of six for allying with it. So I get no additional happiness and theoretically losing half my coal. Let me know what you guys think I should do. Uh, let's go ahead and trade with, what was it, Mombasa? Yeah. And let's close this up. That's a dangerous trade route, but oh well. 
Let's see, so peace treaty has expired, and I'm not willing to, uh, not at all willing to go to war yet. Um, I'm gonna need my nukes, and I'm gonna need more units than I currently have. Um, that being said, he could declare war on me, in which case I'd be in trouble. But we shall see how that goes. Tourism should spike again with the hotel here, given that I get culture from wonders. So I should be up in the 150 range, maybe? Turns here. Oh, great writer's coming soon. Proxy's a great scientist. Well, that's nice. Okay, so let's see. Uh, do I need a city there? Um, you got a couple by them. No, I won't, uh, Alex. Buy them. Do I need them? No. One less potential ally doesn't really matter here, because it's going to be one less potential ally regardless. I'll be sweeping them up, because I need 84. Um... Yeah, I get... So here, here's what I'm thinking. I'm going to get unhappiness from taking Alamody. I'm going to get at least 17 unhappiness. That's not something I really like. I like my current happiness. I like where it's going. Um, I'll get double coal from allying with them. And I will have... Yeah, and then I'll get, I'll get some military units from them by allying with them. So I think I'm just going to nom them up. I like how it only takes 0.5 movement. That's kind of funny. Okay, I was going to say, like, wh wh what's going on? They just disappeared. Uh, let's see. I don't think I'm anywhere near getting another great engineer. That's 11 turns out. It's going to be closer to... See, at 15, that's going to be another... 9 turns? I right, know. Six turns? Seven turns before I get it because it's going to add more. And it's going to be in a row... Actually, wait, where's it going to be? Oh, God. Isn't that way the heck down here? Yeah, okay. So I'm not going to get it anywhere... My next range engineer anywhere near my capital. So um, we're definitely going to buy it. Uh, probably the same turn that I get... Or the turn before I get my uh, great scientist. SimCity 2013 I really like, especially with the expansions. So here's the thing, if I get, here's the other thing though. If I ally with Almaty, I get military units, I also get votes. I get military units, votes, and three coal, as well as no happiness penalty if compared to taking the city. So I see it as more advantageous to ally with them. A good rule for rocket experimenters to fall. Spies being recruited. Okay, uh, and I can't go there, I can go here though. I have to be in friendly territory, so we'll just... What? What are you morons doing? There we go, I was gonna say. Uh, spy has been recruited. Um, 
with the great fireball going up, I'm not going to really need him anywhere too specific. Let's send him to Almady. Why not? Policy. Um, we're going to want to go down another thing of freedom. Uh, I have a lot of buildings, so capitalism is probably for the best. And I don't really need the chance of, the chance of rigging elections in city-states double. Given how many city-states there are, the chance of me getting it is pretty high anyway. So, do that. Boom, boom, boom. Don't care. Hey, wait, welcome to the party. I'm losing grasp on them, eh? Well, let's give them 500 gold. And that should uh, satisfy them, given that I have a spy that's going to rig elections. And I was going to send you up there. Okay. Yeah, if I have... Oh, you're right, Ace. If I have an airport in both Warsaw... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, do they have to be in both? I think so, don't they? And getting a... Getting a uh, airport in Warsaw wouldn't hurt. So William has completed the Manhattan Project, which is bad. For me. I may just go for the win at this point. Uh, how about just flat? No? No. No. Then no. <laughs> That's way in your favor. Hey, a Japanese fleet! <laughs> oh, he searches for science. You couldn't have done that last turn, huh? Well, let's see, um... Airport, four turns. Uh, 50% calls landmarks. To or from. Yeah, let's, I think it's a good idea to have it anyway. I don't wanna switch you to though. Eh. And then down here. Because then I get the... I, I, whatever I get over here. I like that idea. Good call, uh, Ace. And then I can save my faith for what I really want. Granary, uh, a library, an aqueduct, and then a factory. Oh, hello. Um, yeah, sure, stay here, why not? Okay, so I can, I can buy a city-state, which once again loses the votes, and I get 60 influence by doing this. 3,000 gold. Yeah, I like this idea better. And while we're at it, there's a thousand of that gold right back, and now we're allies with you. So now I'm getting your votes. I'm getting six coal, which is really unneeded, but no happiness penalty. And I'm still getting 25% of your science. So, you know, it, it, it's not as, it's, it doesn't hurt too bad. There, it's, I see advantages and disadvantages to taking and keeping, or taking and allying, rather. It goes either way. Oh, 41 happiness. That's kind of nice. William has made peace with you. Very good. So here's the question, though. Do I want to... Do I really want to wait? Well, we'll see. My next person should be a green engineer. I'll, I'll check it after the scientist goes. I can always buy it later. 
I should still get it first, considering that I'm still building wonders first. And it's just, it would just be a really nice boost if I got it. It's not even really super necessary. Good, we'll just grow it there. Um, choose production. Uh, oh yeah, we want you to be nice and productive. Uh, barracks. After that, that sounds fine. Actually, you know what we'll do? Is I'm gonna build one of the bombs over here. It's not too bad. It'll be less than 11 turns because of the uh, nuclear plant. Renact world leader. Uh, I'm not gonna win, but I'll definitely get some more delegates from it, which is nice. And I should, because I'm getting the scientists in four turns, I should have satellites before I can bring the next vote. So we can work on the International Space Station. No, we're not going to attack you. Um, not for a while, at least. You're too, you're too strong. I hate to admit it, but I don't think I can win this militarily. I could definitely stall. I see. I could stall one of them, but the problem is that I got their four. Oh shoot! Oh, that's no good. Where did he complete it? I don't think this will tell me. I think it automatically just zooms to their capital. That would be the place to build it. But bummer. That's that's kind of that's a bummer. Now, Ally of Mombasa. Very good. <laughs> yeah, it just shows me their capital. I don't know how I can even tell if that's there. Does he seriously already have a space? Oh, I guess, of course, he would. Oh, well. Um, anyway, we're getting the nuke up and running. Uh, let's go ahead and get a second one up and running as well. Ten more turns till Golden Age, which I will then extend even further with my great artist. So I don't want two great engineers. Too. I'm definitely going to want to get the engineer bow over here. Because I'm going to want to rush the CN tower. Wow, I actually had a freeze in single player. There's a lot going on. Culture. Okay. Turn 500. Let's see how we're doing. So, we are two-thirds of the way through the game. And, yeah. The Dutch are just wrecking. I'm going to have to do something to slow them down. Okay. Yeah, I get three from that. Plus additional with the Golden Age. Napoleon has declared war on Gaha Mada. Sucks to be Gaha. Gaha ha ha ha. Have I seen KSI before? I don't even know what that's referring to. So no, I assume not. So this should be another nice boost in my tourism. But I think a science victory... Well, a Diplo victory would be the safest victory for me. Okay. Okay. 
Yeah, 100 faith per turn, huh? But I only have 35. Did I, my faith spike? Or did I spend... I must have spent most of my faith then. Okay, well, we got a great scientist. And that will definitely be enough to get me satellites. So, that will be nice. Why should she become as religious? Since I don't even think I have it yet. I don't even have her my own religion. Why would I want a great prophet? Okay, you're done with that. Good, get all the uranium. I'm gonna get... Oh, you have to have an airport on both. Seven, just over 17,000. Which is basically a free tech at this point. Got Krakatoa, Mount Kilimanjaro, huh? Uh, Mount Kalash? Kalash? Kilimanjaro, or Krakatoa, never mind. And then Kilimanjaro is up here. Cool, so we got it with more than enough time. Wait, was that the Vatican? Proxies, investors. You also seek investors, huh? How much do I need? Boom, there we go. Stealing you away from the Dutch. Alright, so I'm going to get a great scientist in 11 turns. So I'm not even going to get the great engineer next. I'm just getting scientists like crazy. So, I'm going to go ahead and buy a great engineer. And next turn we will rush it. Uh, you have good production, but I don't think there's any real reason to boost it. I got 50 happiness now. I think we're getting more and more specialists. I can't remember, can nukes destroy wonders? I think they can, but at this point, wonders aren't really needed. They're nice bonuses. It doesn't matter what city I build telecommunication, or the CN Tower in. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna build the CN Tower over here. And rush the Hubble Space Telescope. My capital. Uh, I wish it wouldn't switch. I wish it would just drop. That'll give me a nice boost to the CN Tower, which means I'll probably get it. And there I am, only nine votes away from winning. Seven votes next time, theoretically. Okay, well, you know, it's actually time for me to cut the video off. So thank you all very much for watching, and God bless.